how to play through the blues. The blues. You yeah. got to learn how to play through the chord, through the blues. Mm-hmm. He said, because jazz stuff is ain't number one no different mm-hmm. from the blues stuff. And that's what give you that that stair step. Like, I, you know, like you running scales. Mm-hmm. He's like, you run them scales, and you take that, that blues note out, and you playing jazz. So, but he said, what he do, he always keep it to where they can feel it. And then, man, George got this song, uh, George's so funky, man. He got this song called, I mean, I don't know the name of it. Man, that song's so bad. And he doing all that, that up and down stroke with his thumb, man. I'm like, listen to this dude here, man. And every time he come to town, he go out, him and Perry. Perry. And you know my hit? Uh-uh. He'll look good to our player. They all go to the show together. Him and Earl Clue, all four of them, they all mm-hmm. go to the show together. Mm-hmm. And hang out and, and they hang out in George's room and play all night, practice all night. <laughs> yeah. And George said he got to play, man. Wait, what do you mean when Perry go out there? No, when George come here, they get together. Oh, and they hang out at George's hotel room. Yeah. And play. Yeah. That's gotta be George awesome. said he got to play every day. He said if he don't every feel good time, yeah, he don't feel right. Exactly. I'm feeling that too. I'm feeling that. And man, that guy but, said, man, but like you said, dude, end with something bluesy. Mm-hmm. Cause everybody try to play the jazzy stuff, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, you cool. That's cool. Mm-hmm. And you know, mm-hmm. the guys who play the blues stuff be looking at them like, wow, mm-hmm. that's cool. Mm-hmm. Cause, but they used to playing the jazz. But y'all really making people feel it. But the jazzy people don't. A lot of the jazz people don't relate to nobody but other musicians. Right, right, right. True, true. But the but the crowd, which right. is the which is the uh, masses, yeah. we need to. You got to relate to them yeah. mostly. Yeah. When you out there, you got to put that that blues in it. You know what I'm saying? So because they can relate to that now. Right. Now when you come, yeah, you do some jazzy licks, like you said. You know, yeah, you know. But the jazz people are looking at that. You are. You need to please the ears that really, you know, you know, you don't want to get too out there on jazz because men, they don't understand that. Man. So you got to go blue. Look, we did a, we did a, uh, a show and, uh, man, my man came up and he was playing all this, man, he was playing some stuff, man, and he was going so fast and people were just sitting there looking at him, man, and they didn't give a damn no. how fast you can go, man. Right. The regular people don't care how fast no. you go or what. No, man, they don't care about all that. They want to know something they can dance to, they, rock their exactly. head to. Yeah. And that's what this, my first drummer, he used to always try to go into his off timing and off beat. And they, I said, hey, man. They ain't look. understanding that. I said, listen, man, you got all the audience standing up and they rocking. They rocking. You can sit their ass you down. Go to some off timing on. You can ready to sit their ass down because they can't. They can't. They need one, two, three, four. Right. See, it's too complicated. It's too for complicated, them. exactly. So, yeah, very good point. And and what more than we all understand is blues. Yeah. Cause we we was raised in it. Yeah, exactly. That's our, that's like our culture. Like you but said, the white boys. Anywhere you go, the white boys think they can play the blues better. Well, uh-huh. see, they'll turn their distortion and stuff on. And, yeah, y'all put that rock and roll together, put y'all diminished licks and all that. And the blues guys, they sit back and they be looking like, wow. Uh-huh. You ain't you ain't really playing the blues. Like, uh-huh. I went to the um, uh, the, the blues uh, playoff uh-huh. at the Good Talk Center. And my man, Joe Todd, man, he was playing like that Chuck Berry rockabilly. Uh-huh. And then he was doing all these fast licks and that. Man, they don't care about. That's not the blues. No, that's the little, not. The little young kid. Temple stuff is blues. The little young kid came in there and played. He got bet. He only been playing two years and won it, cause he played it like a singer would sing it. Yeah. He he did a verse. The then he did a, like a chorus. Uh-huh. Then he came back and did another verse. Then he did the chorus. Then he solo uh-huh. like right. <laughs> he cause he had it in the form, and the uh-huh. judges looked at that and said, well, he put it in the form when. The white, but the the baddest guy there to me was the white boy. The uh-huh. white boy was up there, man. He was shredding up to my, and I'm looking at because I'm a musician. Uh-huh. I'm like, Damn, man, that motherfucker rolling. Uh-huh. But the white boy really, I mean, the black guy really played the blues. Uh-huh. And then everybody come on, man, it's fixed, it's fixed, it ain't fixed. 
Yeah. You didn't play the blues. You didn't play the blues. Right, exactly. You got it. Yeah. Right. Um, I'm a, I'm still gonna put uh uh I'm gonna I'm gonna do the the main ones which is which is uh uh uh, uh and you want Nas on here though right mm-hmm. okay um, I'm gonna put that you want me to put that, put that in that right now uh, uh, yeah get all my mm-hmm. lipstick that way that way I ain't getting stopped at the pass <laughs> mm-hmm. um. That. And, uh, let, me, let me open up and put uh you can change it that oh you want you don't want to go to sleep right so let's do that no i, I don't if you go to sleep i wanted to wake back up when i shake my mouth right i got you right so that's 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 how you take this and tell it to go don't go to sleep it'll go it'll black out after a certain amount of time, but when you shut your mouth, you know, you don't have to press nothing. Okay. See, that sleep, you have to press your button in order to wake it up. And but you want... There wasn't no waking my hard drive. Exactly, up. you got it. Yeah. So, here, yeah, let's go here, and then... So uh, I wonder, since I got the new hard drive, I wonder what it do. Um, yeah, we're going to wake your hard drive, we're going to say hard drive. Um... Um, I used to do this. Can you get no light? Hmm. So it's going to wake up my external too? Everything. No, uh, uh, your external goes to sleep. You, anything. Anything you have goes to sleep. Oh, matter of fact, let's see here. Yeah, hard disk. Okay, that's your, I think that's your, let's see here. You have a USB setting? Let's see. Just there. Let's enable. Power buttons in the I don't know why I still even got that hooked up. <laughs> if I don't hook it though, somebody will probably bring me a movie I need. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now you don't want to, you don't want to, you want it to go blank. Okay. I'm saying you want your screen to go blank, you don't want no, uh... Screen saver. Screen saver, right. Well, yeah, it don't matter. I had a screen save because I had it set on uh, uh, architect. Oh, oh, I got that. Yeah, I can do that for you. Um, that that's um uh that's um that architecture right here. That's that's called um. That's not screensaver. That's that's your de- your uh, wallpapers. Okay. They right. change. Right. But this is screensaver right here. Um, I don't know. I thought I had on all this joint. Dang on it. Three tabs. Yeah. All this okay. Joint. And then okay. Oops. I don't want to. Do that. Let me say ten minutes. Go into it. And then after after an hour, it'll blank out, okay. and you won't have no screen. Me, but then you can move your mouse and everything and okay. come back up. Um, so which one, 20 minutes yeah. with that doing that? Yeah. Okay. I mean, 20 minutes, it'll start that. Okay. After, and then here, let's put it like this. 20 minutes, it'll start that. After, after an hour, the display will turn off. Okay. And then the computer you don't never want it to go to sleep. 
but this display will turn off. Okay. When you move your mouse, it'll come back on. Okay. Okay. You don't want your computer to go to sleep. If you tell it to go to sleep, then you got to come down here because the light will be blinking. Right. And you got to press that. The mouse won't affect it. The keyboard won't affect it. The only way it'll turn it back on is you, like, like, kind of do a quick, like, yeah, I just did that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Don't hold it. Right. If you hold it, then it's going to shut off, you know. But, um, uh,